Italy has always been leading the world's fashion trend. In February 2018, the exhibition Italiana, Italy through the lens of fashion, 1971 to 2001, was held at the Palazzo Reale in Milan, demonstrating the three-decade development of Italian fashion. In this exhibition, we are analyzing one precise time, that is the pret a -Porter. Before that, there was couture. Italian was atelier and couture. And then around the, the 70s, we, we made this starting with 71 with Walter Albini. We start this beautiful uh, uh, journey that was the journey of uh, creative pret a -porter. So they choose nine arguments and uh, the, the nine rooms of the, of, of the exhibition and it was uh, very correct, I think, to understand better the period and what's happening and what was in the creative, in the creative world of Italy in that time, to put together the picture, photographer, artist, artist, together with fashion. The exhibition featured nine themed sections. The identity section shows the menswear influence on women's wear. Gender identity first became a topic in the design of Italian fashion. In the democracy section, you can find photos of the 1980 Giorgio Armani Spring Summer Collection, which exemplifies the liberating and egalitarian spirit back then. The famous 101-801 coat by Max Mara symbolizes the feminine elegance with its iconic tough silhouette. The Logomania section is filled with logos. On both clothes and bags, big logos were printed extensively, catering to the relentless passion of a brand enthusiast. From then on, a brand's logo itself became a design element. In the late 70s and the early 80s, industrial design was introduced in experimental fashion. In the diorama section, interior photographs from the Domus magazine, published in 1983, are reproduced. Moving on to the project room, you can find fashion items shown on work tables instead of dummies to emphasize the design itself. Lines, patterns, and exaggerated stickers reflect the creativity of Italian fashion, just like a kaleidoscope. The bazaar section exhibits an exotic style. The design codes merge Eastern and Western cultures, and accessories are filled with the spirit of adventure. The bad taste in the 90s did have a big influence on Italian design. In the post-production section, unconventional outfits are found, expressing the unique attitude of Italian fashion. From the 70s to the 90s, national elements were used in design. In the global section, sceneries of Sardinia and Naples, or Neo-Baroque, are transferred to clothes through traditional craftsmanship, making Italian crafts even more international. The Italy of Objects section assembles must-buy items of major brands. These highly recognizable handbags, shoes, and garments are all representative of Italian fashion. Italian fashion is peerless in the world, and it walks hand-in-hand -hand with social and cultural developments.